welcome back to my channel today. I know, are you guys sick of me yet? Because I've just like been on a roll here. But anyway, I'm gonna take you guys along with me today and show you guys like my day, our day, what I eat in a day. The last video was of the weekend and we went to like our friend's event, then we went over to Jamal's parents' house and then um, I just kind of showed you guys in that video um, what I had that day and like how I try to keep things low carb when I am out at parties. Wanna say hi? Hi. So, so anyway, I'm gonna take you guys along with me today. It's Sunday morning. Actually, it's not morning anymore. It's actually 1 p.m. and I forgot my watch. So, 107. We're on our way to the Oriental Market um, just to grab a few things. I've really been craving papaya salad, and so we're gonna go get a papaya. And you know, just to kind of show you guys, like, you know, I, did, I don't just eat my meal preps, I change it up here and there, and like whatever I'm craving. I have it I don't hold myself back I'm not limited like you know you have to just have it in moderation so I'll show you guys oh my camera okay I don't know this camera is like not staying guys so anyways I hope you guys enjoy this video let's go and get a few things from the oriental market yeah it's rice I told you I love rice Hey guys, we just left the Oriental Market and I still need to go to uh, Aldi real quick because I need lime. But we're gonna stop by Subway real quick and get some lunch. Don't stick your tongue out. Please put it back in, thank you. So how old are you gonna be? Seven. Wow. April 7th. Yep, April 7th, you're gonna be seven. Why does everyone keep saying that? Okay guys, so let me show you guys what I got from the Oriental Market. I grabbed limes from Aldi. Okay, we've got some Thai holy basil here. We're probably gonna make like a stir fry later this week. We've got some peeled garlic. We've got some tomatoes. We've got a can of this coconut milk. And then the star of the show is my papaya. Look how big this is, it's like the size of my head. Oh, and then I got these green onions. Oh my God, first of all, they were, they were 50 cents. And look how like fresh and big this is. This goes good with like an omelet. Okay, so you cannot have papaya salad without sticky rice. So I told you guys that today is like, I'm eating things that I'm craving in moderation. So we're gonna make sticky rice. I'm not saying this is keto friendly or low carb because it's not, but this is what you will need. You can also throw it in the microwave, but this is like the Thai style and way. I got this from Thailand. I brought it in my suitcase and then I got this from the Thai like super grocery store here. So. It's, we're basically just steaming the rice. So let's fill this up with water. And then with sticky rice, I'll show you guys the brand that I use, but you need to let it soak in water for at least four hours. Overnight is like the best they say, um, but this has been soaking since this morning. And I did just a little bit because I know that um, I shouldn't be eating too much of it. So it's soaked, so this is, filled to about right here. So just enough so it boils and steams up. And then you're gonna put this right on top. It's right in. And so yeah, we're just gonna let this boil for now. Micah just brought this over. This is a little Thai sticky rice holder. So this is a really big papaya. So I have two different types of shredders. This one is to just get the green off. And then we're gonna switch shredders. You can also use a knife and then cut it that way, but I, this is such, it's, it's easier. And then you just shred it. Yeah. Okay, 
Next, you'll need one of these. I think in English it's called a mortar. You're gonna add chili flakes. These are dried chili flakes. They're probably very spicy and good. It just cooks better, or not cooks better, it's just better with papaya salad rather than fresh. This is special seasoning, AKA MSG. That's what it looks like. Tomatoes. Okay, so now you want to throw in your lime. We cut it into like these sizes here. You squeeze and just throw the whole lime in there. If you like it super sour, you just do a whole lime. I typically just do a whole lime because I like mine very sour. Me too. Oh my god, I forgot the garlic. You were supposed to crush these up with the peppers, so we're gonna throw them in now. Alrighty, and then fish sauce. Probably don't have this laying around, but if you do. And then this is the special ingredient. This is fermented fish sauce. I'm gonna add about maybe three spoons of this gives it lots of flavor now you want to add in your papaya all right and then from here you just add additional to your liking so I can tell like my papaya salad is like not dark enough that means I need to add more fish sauce, fermented fish sauce, and let's do MSG. It is definitely an acquiring taste, so don't don't make it if you don't think you're gonna like it. <laughs> That's what it looks like and then just a tight lid keep that on there and then it will turn into sticky rice all right guys so we've got chicken wings, papaya salad and then the carby stuff which is the sticky rice so and if you're wondering if the kids or jamal eats this with me uh no jamal does not eat papaya salad He'll eat sticky rice, I, I think. I eat papaya But Micah salad. does. Micah eats everything with me. So he'll eat sticky rice, papaya salad. He'll eat all the Thai food. It's Harry, spicy stuff. Harry, you want sticky rice? Here, try it. Hot. It's rice. It. Everything's spicy. You want sticky rice? Yeah. Here, I'm going to give some to Micah. Oh, this is very hot. I'm also going to do some ASMR or something with it. Want some chicken? With it? So you want some chicken? You want no. chicken? So you roll it up in the ball. Yeah, and then eat it. Eat the papaya salad. And then you can Get eat some it. some papaya salad. Grab some papaya salad like this. And then you just. Make sure it's not that spicy mm. for you. But it's not spicy. So good, you guys. This is like my treat this week. Mm. Open! Mm. Papaya salad. I'm good. I'm good. Mm. Okay. So good. Yeah, so Glad I was able to show you guys. So guys, uh, Micah's gonna show you guys how he eats his sticky rice and papaya salad. So Here's. I did. So take your sticky rice, <laughs> dip it all the way in, okay? Dip it. <laughs> Hello, Thai boy. <laughs> Spicy? Yes, it is. You want to try some? Yeah. Ball. Do the Eat it. You're hot. Right. Guys, I am sweating so much. It's so spicy. Mm. Woo. Hi, guys. It is the next day. I'm so sorry I did not end the video yesterday because after I had the papaya salad, a little bit of sticky rice, and chicken wings, I literally fell asleep for like. I don't know, 13 hours. 
it's the next day um we're gonna just make this video into like a what i eat in a day like thai edition because i am about to make a thai omelet for breakfast now to eat with my papaya salad so let me show you guys like the traditional way of how to make a thai omelet okay we're gonna crack two eggs i'm going to add a little bit of fish sauce not too much and then we're going to add green onion and then we're going to add turkey bacon mix 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 and we're also going to add a little bit of this soy sauce just literally a little bit and then a little bit of this it's called roti it's like a seasoning this is Kerrygold butter and then we will just add how you make like a Thai omelet. So, and then we're gonna pair it with my papaya salad. No rice today because I've had enough and that was just yesterday because it was the weekend. So we have our two eggs, Thai omelet style with turkey bacon and green onion. And then we still have a bunch of papaya sal salad left. So this, my mouth is just like drooling because <laughs> this looks so good. All right, we're gonna have breakfast. And this will be my breakfast. Hey guys, I'm currently editing this video and I just wanted to end the video and let you guys know um, that yes, it's just a short video of showing you guys like the days that I do have carbs, what I eat, and also like just a mixture of my Thai cuisine into the mix as well. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. The next video will be a low carb video, but um, if you need ingredients or have questions about Thai food and you know, just anything, just leave me a comment. I hope you guys got a little taste of what I eat. And um, yeah, I love you guys. See you guys in the next video. Bye.